What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Critical Overload here. Since I'm about Harry Potter in this video here today, I'm going to be talking about this old report that I already did a um, video on, but it's more of a collaboration video in the past. So I just want to do a full length video talking about this topic of of Harry Potter being rebooted in the next three to five years. This again was coming from WDW Pro. Uh, it was an exclusive leak. They put out a tweet like a day before Christmas Eve about this, saying that Warner Bros. Discovery is reportedly looking to reboot the Harry Potter film franchise, including recasting in the next three to five years. We will release some details of how I became aware of this information presented by a source on the on the Valent Renegade renegade game channel tomorrow morning so i'll leave a link to that video if you want to watch that but i just wanted to share my thoughts on this just more in the full length way so when it comes to harry potter the harry potter franchise we know has been working on these spin-off movies the fantastic beast movies since 2016 all the way up until now it's had some things that have been basically causing it to put be put to bed what the ezra miller drama the jk rowling drama and then also the fact that the movies just have not been hitting what I guess Warner Brothers was hoping they would be doing at the box office compared to, of course, what the Harry Potter franchise, the main stories were doing previously before they concluded in 2011 with Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows Part 2. So they're now in the mindset of, OK, we got to shake things up. We need to do something different. We have something to look forward to in less than a month, I think, with the Hogwarts Legacy game, which I would imagine is definitely going to be something that they look at and monitor and see what fans say while playing this game and use that to progress forward into saying okay this is the next movie we should be doing or the next route we should take a movie because when it comes to the movies themselves that are not the fantastic beast movies but the main harry potter movies a part of the harry potter franchise those movies are not that old so if they were to actually go f back from the back to the beginning restart it retell harry's story retell snape's story uh retell all of the stories over again in film format i would be against that now what i wouldn't necessarily be against that i know many other people would definitely be open to not that you would want to or prefer to see this because again those movies are so fresh but if you were to retell this story again do not do it in a movie format it would be wonderful to somehow see them do it in television format because many people myself included can easily recognize that when you watch the movies and if you're someone who grew up reading those novels you know that those movies are leaving a lot of those novels not really re not really recognized in the, in the movies because of the fact that they had to shorten it can make it work for a two hour and 30 something minute movie format when we know that the books are so much more richer with so many other different plot threads better character development so if you were to format it into a tv show with multiple seasons that build up to the finale harry potter and the, the deathly hallows think of all the years of character development you have the years of just these more rewarding arc finishes and the way you could say that this actually does the book does the books more justice than the film franchise and that's not to knock the film franchise because again it is a well-made film franchise it, it is it has strong performances great direction great cinematography uh very emotionally impactful in a lot of ways when you watch these movies because of all the talent that came together to bring this wizarding world to life but they are again limiting what they can do because of the fact that these are movies they're not it's not a tv show so if they were to redo harry potter from scratch i would love to see it done in the form of a tv show i don't know who would what network it would be on necessarily uh, actually that's that's stupid of me <laughs> i it, it would definitely be on something like hbo max or hbo but uh I could see it lasting for maybe 10 seasons, 10 seasons. Maybe you do 12, not not even 12. I honestly think that Harry Potter and the rich stories that are in these novels would justify a show, a show like that. Going back to the traditional format we haven't seen recently with a lot of shows where you have 22 episode seasons. Think of something like that going on where you have 22 episode seasons of Harry Potter stories being told in television format. I could see that working out and definitely being something that over time people do come would come to love, at least the new generation. Maybe not people like me who grew up with the movies, but in my perfect world, what I would love to also see them do is tackle a story centered on Ramus's child, who we know is Harry Potter's godson, I believe. So you could do something there, telling a story in between the events of what happened 19 years later and also his time at Hogwarts. Factor Harry in along the way and give us some insight as to what's going on with Harry and his career as an as an as an aura. We could do that, or you could do a prequel series focusing on the Marauders and developing those characters, uh, Ramus, Sirius, Peter Pettigrew, etc. 
do a series centered on Voldemort and build that build that show up into the first Wizarding War, seeing stuff like that play out. I also, yes, wouldn't even be against if they were to revive this universe and reboot it because reboot doesn't necessarily have to ultimately just mean remaking the story that's already out there. I would love to see them tackle again a whole 22 episode formatted series maybe five seasons that build up the story of Voldemort up until the conclusion of the very first Wizarding War and a it's a whole show that is a prequel to the events of the first set of Harry Potter movies and then after that you could do something afterward set in the same Wizarding World but it's after Harry Potter's time it's after his kids time it could be something related to a whole completely new character even that's not connected to Harry Potter but at this point with something happening in three to five years is that's the window if Harry Potter is involved in it and you try to do a cursed child adaptation, there is so much I think that you would have to rework in your own way. J.K. Rowling has already received some criticisms for the simple fact that we know that she works best when it comes to writing novels, not screenplays, which is why the Fantastic Beasts movies got some criticisms when it came to the writing department. So if you wanted to do a Harry Potter centric narrative once more that's set after Deathly Hallows... And it's a cursed child adaptation. I can only imagine what you would want to cook up. I would eliminate the stuff related to connecting a villain to Voldemort. Don't really rely too heavily on Voldemort. Let this new villain stand on its own. I also think that you would probably not not focus it on Harry's kids, but maybe some other individual. Or even still, you could do this. Completely shake it up. Harry Potter and the Cursed Child could just be a movie centered on Harry Potter tackling a case as an horror that's related to a child that just has one of the darkest narratives you could tell for harry as it pertains to his life again as a as a wizarding cop and this is just a very dark tale that you could that you could use as a sequel to deathly hallows we could catch up with harry it could be a simple one and done but in my in, in what they have planned they want to do like a complete revival of the universe obviously so if you wanted to bring it back via a TV show, I would prefer you do it with a prequel series that bridges through the first Wizarding War and acts as a prequel to the movies we already have. If you do a movie, I would prefer you rework The Cursed Child into something completely different from a more talented screenplay writer than J.K. Rowling. You guys can let me know what you would love to see from Harry Potter and a reboot down in the comment section below if it's actually going to happen in three to five years. If you haven't already, of course, make sure you go ahead and subscribe. Turn on post notifications and never miss a video. In the description, I will have a link on my social media accounts i am on facebook twitter and instagram you can message me there of course let me know if there's any movies news or reviews you'd like me to cover in the future and with all that in mind guys i will see you in the next video